Alrighty. Let's do it. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. I'm excited already. It's April Fools. Nothing could nothing could go wrong. It's Smash. You're starting out with Smash. And it's Mewtwo, baby. It's Mewtwo! Look at that body! Look at that body, baby. Oh man. Ooh, baby. Whoa, he's spiking. He looks so good, like... I haven't played with Mewtwo since Melee, I'm excited. I wonder if it's... I wonder what his final smash will be, just like the Mewtwo X and Y shit. Jesus Christ, he looks so good. Oh, there it is. There's Y. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, yes. I'm so hyped. Hello, everyone. Hi, Iwata. God, he, look at this guy. He's so skinny. What you just saw is a new challenger video for Super Smash Brothers. It took some time look at him. He makes Britney Spears look like a whore. After the game I'm just kidding. Completed. No, so I'm, I'm not kidding. Have to make you wait, but Mewtwo will join the battle. <laughs> Woo! Super Smash Brothers for Wii U and yes. Nintendo 3DS on April 25th. No, I gotta wait! I gotta wait a month! Ugh. And, as a previously announced, club Nintendo members who have purchased and registered both the Nintendo 3DS and Wii U version of the game before March 31st will receive a free download code for the Galaxy yes. on April yes. God damn it! I love you. Love you, Sakurai. I love you. A software update on April 15th as well. In the Sharing future, the functionality with photos, mini fighters, replays, custom stages, and more. Downloadable content for Super Smash Brothers. Here's a taste of what we have in the room. First, we'll be adding more. Who's that? The lead singer of Rob Zombie? <laughs> What the hell? <gasps> the cat! The cat! Whoa, man! Majora! Don Ban! Mega Man X! Oh my god, you need. This is great! <laughs> oh, zero! Oh, zero! Oh, zero! For the first wave of crossover items, huh. we created. Oh, 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 that's cheap too. That's that's cheap. I like it. I like that so much. The, the freaking cat suit, man. I gotta wear that. That's not all of the new content. There's more. Please take a look at this. What the hell are you talking about? What the hell are you talking about? No, oh my God. No. You 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 can't be serious. Is, is, is it, is it my boy, my boy in the striped shirt? He's back. He's back. For God's sake, he looks so good. Of course, he comes out of nowhere. You know what else is coming out of nowhere? Oh, oh, what's that? My shoe? What's that? My shoe? Oh, look at all this money. Look at all this money. Oh shit! Did I mute it? <laughs> oh shit! I muted it. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. I'm alright, bro. I'm alright, bro. Look at the money. I don't have I don't have dollars this time. I'm broke. I got change. I got fucking change. Jesus Christ, man. That 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 leak was right. You know the one with Lucas and Mewtwo? It was right. And he looks so good. Look! Look at him! Look at it! <laughs> oh my god, this is awesome. You this oh my god. Lucas from I, to be honest, I played I Lucas more than that, so I am more than glad. Plus, Mother 3 is better than Earthbound. I'm sorry, I gotta say that right there. We are still hard at work, but 
We are planning his release. That's fine. That's fine. I imagine Do it. You may have some fighters in mind yourself. Can you think of anyone you'd like to see fight against characters like Mario or Link in Super Smash Brothers? Mark Rider. Well, how about the eggplant? I it with Smash Brothers director Masahiro Sakurai. Put Sakurai in it. Decided to open the new Smash Brothers fighter. Oh yeah! I am gonna Brothers spam. Microsite after I'm gonna. Nintendo <laughs> there are so many possibilities with, with that. Ball, you can let us know directly which <gasps> character you'd like to see. <laughs> the next new oh my God. We're just gonna put. I'm just gonna put penis in that. I'm just gonna make penis a fighter. Please work with me to put penis as a fighter. Every request, but Mr. Sakurai and the rest of the staff penis into consideration when developing additional fighters. Oh my God! You can have the steam fighters. From codename Steam, you could have Major not Majora. Maybe, maybe Majora. You could have Shovel Knight and Rayman. You could do that. A pack sack. <laughs> oh, July. We got the, the Kid Icarus Uprising duo, and we got the newbies. But uh. <laughs> And that Wario is compatible with Mario Party 10. We'll be releasing a number of amiibos <sighs> exclusively through retail partners. Keep an eye out for announcements from these retailers to find out when you can pre-order. Iwata, you skinny Before, bastard, I love you. you. Are looking forward to and it's only been almost 10 minutes. Amiibo in Super Smash Brothers. Rest assured. We'll also be releasing Amiibo of Mewtwo and Lucas. This is, this is awesome. This is 10 minutes in. Next up, this is how good Nintendo is. Amiibo tap Nintendo's greatest bits. <laughs> this downloadable title for Wii U lets you touch Amiibo on the Wii U gamepad to unlock gameplay highlights from select NES and Super NES titles. Each demo is limited to three minutes. I gotta play so Super Mario World again. I haven't played that in years. <laughs> Such a fantastic game. You can add an amiibo to the game card multiple times to switch out which scene is highlighted. That way, you can sample a variety of scenes. The game assigned to the amiibo you use are not predetermined. Instead, titles are randomly assigned when you scan your amiibo oh whoa really <laughs> so i could get so in that way it's like a box like, of chocolates you never, never know, know what, what you're you gonna going get to. lieutenant dan just seriously see, that's my favorite movie i'm not kidding you just made my day nintendo time. even though this is so an april fool's prank it's sort of like swapping game cartridges from an old nes or super NES. Man, so good. Amiibo Tap Nintendo's Greatest Bits will be released on the <sighs> Nintendo eShop this spring. Oh shit! Free download. Good, my Mario Amiibo is not gonna collect Let's, dust then. <laughs> let take a look at this. Mario Maker. Oh man, let's go. Thir oh, the 30th anniversary, that's right, it's 2015. I remember back in 2010, I got the 25th edition of Mario All-Stars, so yeah, it's coming. The year... Yeah, 30th anniversary, that's what it's saying. It's a Mario. It's my favorite. It's my favorite plumber. Super Mario. He's a my favorite video game character. Seriously, he's been with me through my childhood. That's how much I support Mario. I cannot wait. I will buy whatever they're s you're what selling. Just saw was a 30th anniversary commemoration video. See this hat? It with the Wii U game Mario Maker. That's right. It's been 30 years since the launch of the original Super Mario Brothers game on the NES in 1985. I couldn't 
be happy at that. Mario has continued to be active across a wide range of games. Thanks in no small part to the love you all have for Mario. Me I'm included. Extremely thankful. There I love Mario. No better way than an anniversary celebration to gear up for what will be a definitive Mario experience. It's the e it's the era Mario. Mario. The era Mario. Mario Maker is a game that lets you use the Wii U Game Pass to create and play Mario level. All you have to do is place characters or other pieces from Mario games onto the level. <laughs> that way, anyone can create unique levels. You'll be able to switch between <laughs> Kaizo <and> Mario. <laughs> oh, Mario 3 and World. Oh man. Oh, they got a Herobro sprite. For a Mario World, that's awesome. I, I'd like to see the new sprites they have for some of these. I need to move my microphone. There we go. Totally tubular. Alrighty. The Eve of Ariel. Woohoo! Buddy, now, you're amazing. It's Bill Helm screen! It's Bill Helm screen! What's that shirt? What's that shirt? First, Zero. Yoshi's Woolly World is a creative and lovingly crafted new entry in the Yoshi series. It reimagines fan favorite gameplay elements and makes them feel brand new. As you can see, Yoshi's latest adventure is an action game that takes place in a woolly world spread across varied stages, featuring fun yarn challenges. <laughs> that, this is so adorable, this game. If you haven't played Kirby's Epic Yarn, you have to. You have to. use his signature moves, like gobbling up enemies or flutter jumping. Meanwhile, he'll explore every I cannot, cranny like, it, it sucks looking at the computer and on YouTube, but think of this on the console itself. This will look fantastic. Classic mode and mellow mode. Classic mode has a similar feel to traditional Yoshi series games. And despite the game's cute visuals, it will prove quite challenging, even for veteran players. Good, so it's harder than Kirby's Epic Yard. ...and allows players of all skill levels to enjoy the game as Winged Yoshi. Oh my Happens god. ...to have the cutest voice you can imagine. <laughs> you can switch between the two modes at any time during play, so if you get stuck in regular mode, you can switch over and continue enjoying yourself in mellow mode. That's if you're told wuss! Oh. I should mention, there are also special Yoshi Amiibo. While the current lineup of Amiibo figures Whoa. are made of hard materials, this Amiibo series is created from yarn, just like the what? heroes of Yoshi's Woolly World. Oh! When you tap oh. the Yoshi Amiibo on the Wii U game pad, <gasps> another Yoshi will appear got, in the game, allowing you to have play it. with double Yoshi. That is so cute! Now, even when you're playing single <laughs> player, That's you so won't cute. feel like you're playing alone. As in the oh my mode, god, playing with they're always Yoshi thinking. Lets you turn your ally hey, it's a doodle jumper. <laughs> enemies or to cross chasms. It really expands the gameplay. Yoshi's Woolly World will launch <laughs> later this year. Oh man, Your I gotta Yoshi wait. I can't wait for three that different game. Colors, oh green, my god. Pink and light blue. Oh yeah. I'm, Next I'm up hyped. is Splatoon. Ooh. In this action shooter, you control squid-like inklings who can transform into humanoids. So far, we've introduced a four-on-four -four online ink battle mode called Turf Wars. Oh, that's another idea! The Splatoon guy for, for, for Smash! Do it! Where you set off Splatoon on your for Smash! ...the Inklings' natural-born enemies, the Octopus Army. But today, we'll show you two more modes. The first is an online mode called Ranked Battle. Just like in Turf Wars, you'll team up with three other players to battle it out in four-on-four -four matches. However, this mode includes a ranking system. Ranked Battle has several rules that differ from Turf Wars. In one mode called Splat Zones, players battle Splat. over a specific area within a given stage, so you can expect some fierce battles between two teams to go down here. Polish your skills against the Octarian Menace in single player, hit up Turf Wars for a casual multiplayer matchup, 
Honestly, I'm not a fan of like shooters, but you know what? This looks creative. Like it's not just killing people; it's just taking territories. Like there's a lot of Mario Party games that I like that are focused around this. So you know what? This is good. This is I would actually like to play this with people. Each one competing to see who can pop the highest number of balloons in a given stage. You can play this mode on the same stages as in Turf Wars, so just like in a real dojo, you can practice your moves and learn the layout and locations of obstacles. To and that's good. I do like training too, so that's we a big help. One more Splatoon announcement today. We've decided to release Inkling Amiibo. There right you go. The People who didn't when say this was going to happen, to the game screw pack, you. You'll receive missions or Splatoon you. you tap in. By completing these missions, you can acquire special weapons and gear that you can only get from these compatible Sit. Amiibo. Oh jeez, it's the Arbiter. <laughs> oh god, no, the, the fan fiction, all the fan fiction! Oh my god, Nintendo, you, you, you brought this upon you yourself. <laughs> girl or the Inkling boy individually the same day. Oh yeah, they did say they have a live Moving conference. On, I'm happy to announce that we'll be adding Nintendo 64 yes! and Nintendo DS games to yes! our Wii U virtual console service. When playing Nintendo DS virtual console games, your TV monitor and Wii U gamepad will provide multiple dual screen layout options. To oh, maybe you can get 999 in there because Some I'm looking for that your game. TV monitor is the main screen, while others will use both screens as one connected screen. No matter what type of Nintendo DS game you're playing, you can select a layout that best suits that title. So good. For Nintendo 64 Virtual Console titles, you can select from one of three different control schemes and then configure specific buttons Oh my buttons god, to that's gonna be a clusterfuck. Or match the layout of the Nintendo 64 controller. And yes, if a particular oh, Donkey Kong 64. Pack on Nintendo 64, the Wii U gamepad will be ready to... I have not played that yet. I should get on that bandwagon. Both Nintendo DS and Nintendo 64 games can be played on the Wii U Put the, let, let them have Banjo-Kazooie in there and just screw everyone over. And then Banjo for Smash. ...purchased on Wii and transferred to Wii U will be available at the special discounted price of $2 each. Oh, man. Yoshi's Island I have, oh, I have so many, I have so many games. I have so many games on my Wii already. This is going to be good. Super Mario 64. So the good. Following titles will also be available soon. My favorite game, Super Mario 64. This is this is the greatest day. My favorite video game. Next, my favorite movie reference. So good. This is the greatest April Fool's Day ever. Thanks, Bill. There's a lot of great Who stuff. Who the fuck are you? Nah, just kidding. So let's get right into it. Coming to Wii U this May, Adventures of Pip is a puzzle platformer set in a retro-inspired 32-bit world. Pip is the unlikely... What, Thomas was alone mixed with the Shadow of the Colossus? I mean, more like Zelda. <laughs> ...to evolve into three different forms. Skillfully switch between each form while exploring five dangerous worlds... Hey, shut up, Pip! Give me some cheesy poop! ...rescue trapped villagers to unlock new shops, and don't forget to use your gamepad to quickly access your inventory... This is like Zelda? ...travel throughout the land. Oh, this is like Mario bad, World. ...Dadliest Catch is a game all about deception, not to mention destruction, and, of course, dadliness. Also known as fatherhood. In this one, you play as a dad. Oh, that's coming the Wii U. And as such, you'll have to master simple everyday tasks. Made this looks so so silly. Tentacles. Oh my While god! Keeping your cephalopodin nature a secret. I've been thinking about like, getting this too. It, it looks silly. There's no, no you can have my ice cream. Mode, we're up to four players, each control a different tentacle. Collect neckties and learn about Octodad's secret life when Octodad, Dad, all the hentai in the world in one game. And I shall have the mutant muds are back on Wii U and Nintendo 3DS, ready to soil the land in the sequel to the acclaimed original. Mutant muds Super Challenge contains 40 brand new levels filled with dimension bending platforming fun that will have you hopping in and out of the background to discover secret pathways and collect gems. Be prepared to bring your platforming skills because the challenge has been cranked up a notch. Best of all, Over 9,000? game on Nintendo 3DS, you can download it on Wii U for free and vice versa. And if you own the original, a loyalty discount will also be offered. To, and don't stop yeah, one cent. Edition, you'll fight, farm, craft, scavenge, and do whatever it takes to survive in a wilderness filled with science, magic, and things that go bump in the night. Randomly generated worlds and the constant threat of permadeath will keep you on your toes. But luckily, your trusty gamepad will be with you to display your inventory and map, or to play the game in off-TV mode. 
Don't Starve Giant Edition will also Looks like a Tim a Burton remote. kind of style. I like it. Two copies of the game I really haven't heard of this game that much, but it looks neat. It's like looks like a Nightmare Before Christmas in a way. Before I pass it back to Bill, take a look at a number of other titles coming soon to the Nintendo eShop. Bring it, son. Oh. For my eight. Dementium. Don't starve. Fort Space Adventures. Was that an octopus? Oh, never alone. Ah, PS4 is getting that free. That's what I'm getting. <laughs> Ninja Pizza Girl. Buying day one. Buying Ninja Pizza Girl. I will buy. I will buy Ninja Pizza Girl with this. This. This much. Runbo, whoa, man. It's like I D A R B in a way. Then there's Pip. Back to bed. Space Hulk. That looks like a Warhammer. <laughs> Doors. Oh, that's neat. That's almost like Cuphead. Train simulator? Day one. <laughs> Day one train simulator. Day one. Shushimi. It's good. I mean, third party needs to get a little bit better, but you know what? They're doing good. They're doing good. Atlas, yeah. What is it? Is it? Please, for God's sake, it looks like it. It looks like it. <laughs> it better be. I want to see that crossover, baby. I want to see that crossover. Oh my God. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is this a new collaboration game? Is this Persona? Nintendo Persona? I'll, I'll buy that too. A Nintendo Persona game. That would be brilliant. Other than Persona Q, that's brilliant. No, this is the crossover. That looks like Fire Emblem. Oh my god, it looks so good! I mean, holy shit! God! <sighs> yeah, it's like the exploration of Shimagami Tensei in the battle style of Fire Emblem. That's what Fire Emblem needed. More exploration. This is... this is great! Give me a date. Give me a date. First off, thank you for waiting, everyone. Yes. It's been a long time since we announced this project, but the game you just saw is indeed the crossover between yeah. Shin Megami Tensei and yes. Fire that we announced back in Whoa. January of 2013 in a Nintendo Direct. The role-playing masters at Atlas are developing a truly modern RPG where everyday life exists alongside. Is that a Pokemon emblem on his on his vest? Characters from the Fire Emblem series. I hope you're looking forward to it. Is that Lucina? Stay tuned for more information on this title in the future. Now it looked it's like Marth and Lucina. We have taken control over your TV. This is not intended to be an April Fool's break. Now it's time for a new Wii U title that fans have been clamoring for. In this new entry of the Fatal Frame series, Oh, Fatal Frame. <laughs> you didn't even go for any shock factor. You were just like, fuck it. You want Fatal Frame? Here you go, motherfuckers. And it's here. 
Using the Wii U gamepad as your camera, you'll investigate different areas while soaking in the atmosphere. But occasionally, your camera will be used to fend off hostile spirits in quick bursts of action. Ooh -hoo. Prepare for scares when the game haunts the U.S. later this year. Keep your eyes peeled for more details coming soon. All right. Dive into some Nintendo 3DS software. I like the I like how Nintendo's going towards the mature out these days with Bayonetta. They haven't done that since Eternity, Eternal Darkness. And that's been like 13 years, and you got to get that game too. It's fantastic. But yeah, I like Nintendo going towards the hardcore crowd, starting with like the mature titles. It's it's nice to see. Like they haven't forgot about us. They have not forgot about us. Unique structures like the shielding afro, and then use them to protect himself, hit switches, and snake around environments like a boss. Whatever type of like a boss. Chances are you haven't solved many puzzles like these before. So figuring them out just feels good. The soda is parading around in the block. Oh my God. Some of them even make you move faster, jump higher, and look as much like a ninja block as you feel on the inside. Life's good when you're a ninja block. Meme. 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 On the Nintendo e -shop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's tomorrow. Next, the latest game in the Pokemon Rumble series. Pokemon Rumble World. It's a fast-paced action game that you can download for free and start playing right away. It features more than seven Pokemon on red and blue through Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. Some of which can even mega evolve. Making toy Pokemon attack is as simple as pushing a button. To advance in your journey, you'll square off against tons of wild toy Pokemon and defeat them to add to your collection. During your adventure, you'll travel to different areas on hot air balloons. Where you go depends on the type of balloon you're on. As you play, you'll acquire different balloons using items called Poke Diamonds, allowing you to reach more distant areas where you'll encounter new crops of wild toy Pokemon. There are other ways Poke Diamonds aid you during gameplay. You can get Poke Diamonds when you beat certain stages, or even via Street Pass. Or you can purchase them through the Nintendo eShop using funds from your account, which you can access at a shop in Castletown, your adventurer's home base. Pokemon Rumble World will be free to download starting on April 8th. I mean, I really don't have an opinion on Pokemon Rumble. I mean, I haven't really got interested in that, but... RPGs or puzzle games, then the future is it's... looking bright. Right. Because oh, Mario! Mario! RPGs are headed your way in a single package. Puzzle and Dragons... Yeah! Puzzle and Dragons Super Mario Brothers Edition packs in two unique games at a great price. Each game is its own set Yeah, this I'm interested in. I need to know more about this. Characters and gameplay twists. Puzzle and Dragon Super Mario Brothers edition. From what I can tell, it's like bejeweled with party members. This time, Mario and Luigi must take the Koopa King down by crafting the I mean, this is the closest to a Paper Mario game we've got. Look at that party system. Look at it. Look at it. Elemental orbs around the playfield to create matches of 3 or more for greater damage. Chain five or more orbs, and you'll unleash a group attack on multiple enemies. Picking the right team is paradise. Abuse! You'll choose a leader like Mario, or even Boo Luigi. Each of what? Has a passive skill that is For God's sakes! Companions have skills too, only theirs are active. Boo Luigi! A certain number of turns of a a Boo Luigi. Luigi. Your companions can transform, which also increases their level cap. Items like the Super Mushroom or Goomba Coin cause transformations to occur, like a red Koopa So it's like Pokemon too, shit! And that's just one game included in this package. The other half of your purchase nets you Puzzle and Dragon Z, which weaves a whole separate tale that sees you joining an ancient dragon research organization known as the Rangers. On your quest to save the world, you encounter more than 250 monsters, each of which can serve as your team leader providing you with tons of strategic options. And by using chips gathered from defeated monsters, you can even evolve your monsters into new forms. <laughs> Take no Pokemon, you can evolve with puzzle pieces. It's like Banjo. Oh yeah, um, Banjo-Kazooie for Smash. You know you want it. Super Mario Brothers Edition will claw its way to store shelves May 22nd, but you can pre-order it beginning today on Nintendo.com. For 30 bucks, that's really good. Puzzle and Dragon Super Mario I mean, it depends on the replayability of this, but... I mean, it looks fun at all. 
so feel free to try it out. For a really in-depth look at the game and what makes it so compelling, make sure to check out the new video on our YouTube channel that goes up today. Is that Doc Brown? <laughs> Marty! Marty, we gotta play Puzzles of Dragons before your mother goes out to you with to the the out of the sea dance. Oh, Attack on Titan! As an elite member of the Scout Regiment, you can experience the feeling of bringing down a Titan on your own or with friends. Oh man, Attack on Titan, yo! I've gotten into this recently. This is the shit. This is this shows the shit right now. The game also supports the C stick on the new Nintendo 3DS XL for smoother camera control. Mikasa, Mikasa's my girl. To inspire you to join the Scout Regiment when the game releases, the first two episodes of the Attack on Titan anime are now available. Please tell me Potato Girl's playable. <laughs> Attack on Titan, Humanity and Oh, Atlas, this this should be good news, hopefully. Atlas, don't fail me on this. I will buy Attack on Titan. Codename Steam is already challenging players with the depth of strategy you'd expect from our friends at Intelligent Systems. But if you haven't had the chance to try it yourself, feel free to download the demo. It's currently available on the Nintendo eShop. And remember that if you have a new Nintendo 3DS XL, you can tap compatible Fire Emblem Amiibo like Marth yeah, um, are we gonna get more? Because I don't have them. I need them. If you weren't able to get a hold of a Martha Amiibo, don't worry. We'll be releasing more Martha Amiibo in May, so stay in the loop and don't miss your second chance. Good. I gotta pre-order that shit immediately. There's an update. But just wait 15 minutes and then it'll just go out of stock again, like all the goddamn scalpers do it. You, you scalpers out there, you can go, you can go suck a dick. I hate you people. You people are taking the Nintendo out of the real people. You scalpers can scout my butt hair. Scout my butt hair, you you f named for Tom Sawyer himself. This deathmatch tournament will run from today until April 5th. So if you want to participate, follow these steps to see how you stack up to the best of the best. There will be more tournaments in the future, so stay tuned. Top players in these tournaments will even earn special titles that are visible online. Next, I have some info on a new update to Street Pass Me Plaza. The software already contains several games crafted specifically with Street Pass functionality in mind. The last update in 2013 added four games to the plaza. Now, we're bringing two new games to the plaza. The first Battleground one is called Z? Ultimate Angler. All right, in this we'll see this. Game, the player visits the Street Pass Islands to try and catch various fish with bait received <laughs> from me characters via street pass. And for 40 bucks you can do that in Majora's Mask. To hook the fish you're trying to catch. For 60 dollars you can do that in Ocarina of Time because finding that game is a find that game is hard now. Scattered across the islands. Not to mention Well, unless you buy it on the eShop of course, but physically I like collecting games physically. Oh, good feel. In this action game Players receive items based on their Street Pass Me Plaza characters' hobby Whoa. and use them as weapons to beat down Look at that. zombies. That's... It all goes down <laughs> Reggie. Plaza, home to people who take their hobbies. My, my body is ready to kick some zombie ass. To rescue the citizens of Hobbyville, players will make the most of 26 makeshift weapons to best the zombies in each stage. I thought he said hobbits there, you know, the hobbits. I hate the hobbitses. I hate them. I hate the hobbitses. Street Pass Me Plaza Premium is a paid content which offers up new features like Street Pass birthdays. Now you can start filling in the dates of your Street Pass Me characters' birthdays on the new calendar and also store up to 100 Mees of your friends or special Mees in the new VIP. <laughs> Anuma, he's the so funny. The Street Pass Me Plaza will be available on April 16th. Ultimate Angler, Battleground Z, and Street Pass Me Plaza Premium can each be purchased individually inside Street Pass Me Plaza. Fine, but, I mean, maybe for Battleground and Angler, but Premium? And I don't know. Z together, you can get them for a special discounted price. Okay, maybe that's a little bit good. That's a little bit good, PS but it, no. Has a great library of role-playing games. One look around the internet, and you'll find lots of gamer love for titles like Fire Emblem Awakening and Bravely Default. Buy Fire Emblem immediately. Immediately. Do it. Buy Fire Emblem for God's sake. Brand new again, exclusively on the new Nintendo 3DS XL system. The new Nintendo 3DS Excel version and and Xenoblade. You you have to buy Xenoblade too. I'm telling you. And intense real-time battles with new features like the collection. 
Here you can view 3D animated models and listen to the entire soundtrack, even with your system closed. I can do it's that in Smash. Debut, in fact, I have it on my iPod. For Xenoblade Chronicles 3D. Enjoy. I have the whole Xenoblade track on my iPod. Years I, I'll show you. I'll show you. Seems like yesterday. Well, I've got a few. Let's play, um, You Will Know Our Names. Let's play You Will Know Our Names. I mean, you can see this trailer on YouTube, but... You Will Know Our Names. And what else? We have Gower Plain. We're gonna go to Gower Plain, too. And I have one more. I think it's ones who stand in our way. Where is that? Oh, the one who gets in our way. Yeah. Yeah. The one who gets in our way. See? This game has fantastic music. I'm telling you, you need to play this game. You need to go download the soundtrack. You need to um, go buy a new 3DS. You need to go buy Xenoblade 3. And I don't care what the hell you got to do. You just got to go get the Xenoblade Chronicles game. The the, the, the the Xenoblades. I control it. By the light of the Manana, I mean, this is the biggest game I've ever played, like... I will stop them. It's... it's so huge, like... I mean, this game took me the longest. It took me longer than Fallout, it took me fa longer than Skyrim. It's a long-ass game. I think it took me maybe a year and a half. I, it's it's huge. I'm telling you, just you won't regret it. Trust me, you will not regret it. And it's coming next week. You gotta go do. It. You gotta do it. I'm telling you, the voltage recommendation. Wink. You won't regret it. Let's move on to the new Fire Emblem game for Nintendo 3DS, which we announced in the last yes. Nintendo Direct. As in Fire Emblem Awakening, the Whoa. main will be a customizable avatar. Good. However, oh, new game, avatar for Smash! New avatar for Smash! Like Do it! Or even a partner for the main character. This time around, for the first time in the series, your created character is the main protagonist of the game. Oh yeah. Today, I would like to show you a new trailer that highlights some changes only made possible because the player is now the main hero. He's so good. Me. I control my own destiny, Lucina! Not you, you crazy bitch! What if you could rid the world of war? What if nature could be conquered? What if you could do the Harlem Shake? <laughs> no, just kidding. Is that a Kuma? Two kingdoms in the crossroads of war and peace. Two divergent paths will shake the kingdom's fate. <laughs> the peace-loving Hoshino. The glory-seeking Lord. Is that Hey Hachi? He's gonna he'll, he'll just blast everyone on a rocket ship. I'm curious as to when in the timeline this will occur, like, will this be more future than the previous Fire Emblem, or... I mean, I could say, like, maybe 1900s, 1800s? Who knows? Oh shit, Karma System. All infamous. Oh, Ninja Class. What the? Oh, oh baby, oh baby. <laughs> oh baby, oh baby. Mayor Quimby wants to get in that election. Can you give me a release date? Can I? Can I have a release date? <gasps> Can I have a release date? No. Okay. <laughs> Maybe soon. There are two kingdoms at war. Peace-loving Hoshiro and the glory-seeking Nor. 
It's up to the player to decide which side to take. As always, there are two sides to every story, and in this game, the path you choose ultimately decides your character's fate. No matter what, the world and characters will be the same, but depending on the decision you make, the storyline Whoa, the man! Will be drastically different. They're bringing in the Dark Souls fandom. On the Hoshido side, you'll experience a more traditional path as you work together with Seriously, that, if that's not a Kuma, then... Then, um, this path story is more similar to past fire then Abraham of the Walking Dead looks like Joe DiMaggio, who's the voice of Bender. On the other hand, and you'll know what I'm talking about. The Nor, you'll know what I'm talking about. To revolutionize an unruly kingdom from the inside, so the story will be slightly more complex, and the difficulty will be more challenging. Good, good. I'm all for it. I'm all for it. Plan for a 2016 release in North America. Son of a Stay bitch. For more information in the future. Oh, God. <laughs> you may have heard something about these cards I'm holding. Well, we're finally ready to show our hand. These cards feature characters from the Animal Crossing series, and you can use these cards hmm? in a brand new Nintendo 3DS game I'm sorry. called Animal Crossing <gasps> Happy Home Designer. The game offers you a unique oh, way to interact say? with your favorite animals from the series without doing chores. It's all about the home decorating and design aspects of Animal Crossing. In fact, animals will request the player to design a house for them, one that fits their rather specific tastes. Then, it's up to the player to furnish and decorate their homes and meet the animal's request by designing them a home that suits their <laughs> sense of style. Home designer That's voltage man on the duty. I need to get back into Animal Crossing too. I have not played that in amiibo. a while now. It doesn't require a figure. If you have an Animal Crossing series amiibo card, you can tap it in to design a room for the animal on the card. After designing their room, you can scan additional amiibo cards to invite other animals to come visit their house, and then kick back and watch. I think my favorite neighbor has to be. Um, In other words, amiibo um, cards let you experience Filbert. Filbert the squirrel. World than you Filbert the squirrel's my favorite neighbor. Series. Who's your favorite neighbor? Post in the comments. The post in the comments your favorite cards, Animal Crossing neighbor. Game, and I'm not talking about main character, but you could post that too if you like. Mine's mine's Isabel. Mine is Isabel. NFC reader writer accessory on the same day as Animal Crossing Happy Home Designer. That way, you can scan Amiibo on regular Nintendo 3DS and Nintendo 2DS systems as well. We have a couple more announcements to make on an existing title that Mr. Iwata will cover. See you next time. It's Skinny Boy! It's Luigi! Final game. I have some new information about It's a Mario Kart. Let's go! Look at the DLC! So good! I've been ro- Nintendo be like, I've been rolling in the Monday, bitches! My bae. That's my bae, Rosalina. That's my bae. Oh man, is that the- that, that looks good! I like that Animal Crossing course. That looks- that looks- oh, Rossetti, run that motherfucker! What run him you over! Fuck right him! I hate Rossetti! Stupid Rossetti! I've nightmares about that goddamn creep! Get him, you son of a bitch! I hate you! Oh man. Bye, Bay! Rosalina! Alright, I'll, 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 I'll tone down the Rosalina obsession. <laughs> Good. I, I love what they're doing with the music. Nintendo has really amped up their game when it comes to the soundtrack. Ever since Super Mario Galaxy, it's just been uphill. Oh, ho, 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 
Is that the Pac-Man and Sonic? Please bring back Rosalina. Please bring back the Rosalina Amiibo. I swear to God. Please bring back the Rosalina Amiibo. Tell me. Tell me. You sexy son of a bitch. The Mario Kart series has been a part of many gamers' lives for over 20 years, ever since the debut of Super Mario Kart for the Super Nintendo Entertainment System in 1992. Each entry in the series has featured gameplay that appeals to kids and adults alike by offering three main racing classes. 50cc. To, which can not, play not when they're rubber banding your ass from, like, two miles away. That's the flaw of a 64, even though it's kick-ass. Double Dash has to be my favorite. Wii's still, Wii's pretty good. I still play that from time to time. But Double Dash is my boy. The fuck? No! I can't do it! I can't do it! <laughs> oh no! All oh, my dick's gonna get ripped off. They're gonna they're they're just asking for my dick to get ripped off. I can't do it. But actually, 50 cc is really not 150 is not that bad in this game. So, you know what? It might be good actually. <laughs> I'm just over exaggerating. Well, you can't have two bullet bills at once. Bay, Bay, don't be taunting me. I love you. I need your amiibo. I never knew you could fly over that. Ever since the original Super Mario Kart game, yeah, free 200 CC. God. Jesus Christ. Because it's so fast, you have to have a good braking skill. Around tight corners, it's Mario Kart like you've never experienced it before. This not only applies to the new downloadable course, every course in the game will offer a 200 CC class in local and online play. Alongside Mario Kart 8 DLC Pack 2, an update adding 200 CC. Actually, I correct myself. Double Dash was my favorite, but it's tied between DS and 8. Both of those are fantastic games, and 8 is just so good. <laughs> I can't emphasize how so good, like, that's all I can say, so good. Like, I can say great, I can say super. It means the same thing. Like, just Nintendo just amps up the quality. Like, that's because Nintendo gives a shit. Nintendo gives two fucking shits about us. The, the player, that's all they care about, they us. And that's what I love about it, and it's over. That was, that was great. That was honestly a super direct, like, we got, we got Fire Emblem, we got Mario Kart, we got, we Smash! For God's sakes, Lucas and Mewtwo! It's, it's so good! Oh, man. Well, yeah, this was, this was a great April Fool's Day, and Homestar come back. If you don't know Homestar Runner, go check it out. They got a new Strong Bad email. So yeah, um, if I had to give this direct a review, I would give it a 9 out of 10, because it was just surprising, it full of good news. So yeah, this was my April Fool special to you guys, I'm VoltageBand65, and I will see you guys later.